the lake at Levi Carter Park, usually full of boats, this weekend will fill with thousands of swimmers. Is there any part of it that makes you unnerved anymore? Or? Oh, just being swum over. <laughs> Among them, an 86-year-old nun who says being a triathlete was not a choice she made. I don't think I decided at all. <laughs> That, that man upstairs has a devious sense of humor. Sister Madonna Buter is the Iron Nun, seen here in pictures from previous competition. She became a nun at 23, a triathlete at 52, an Ironman at the age of 55. When I entered the convent and had a full-length habit, I had no idea that I would be running in Spantex shorts. And this is her next course throughout the Omaha Metro as athletes from across the country check in. There you are, good luck. Organizers hope for smooth sailing. Obviously putting on a race of this magnitude with over 4,000 athletes and involving so many jurisdictions and, and key players within the city takes a lot of coordination. Road closures seen here in this map from the Race Omaha website show traffic may be complicated this weekend. But for the Iron Nun, it's as simple as her mantra. God, help me do my best and you do the rest. Keep the faith and keep moving forward. There is no such thing as failure. The only failure is not to try. Now I know this is a quick glance at this map, but we should note that this week in the south entrance is the only entrance to Epley Airfield that will be opened. The north entrance is closed for most of the day. So we have posted this map right now. It's on KETV.com. Guys, back to you.